I think we're going to see somebody invent something new like Dorian did. And when Dorian walked on the stage, we never saw that. What the hell is this? We never saw that kind of mass and that kind of size. You know, there was a whole bunch of guys that could have possibly won the title. So it was a little bit hard. And also, it's a, it's a barrier to get over. Could it really be me? Could I be the best in the world at my chosen sport? Uh, there was that barrier, and then eventually I got over that. Like, why the hell not? You know, it's got to be somebody. And I don't think anyone's training harder than me. And I always had that inside of me. Like, I don't think anyone could have done any more. So that gives you a lot of strength. First Mr. Olympic contest and people might think, well, he's going to be overawed by the occasion and intimidated. I believe in myself and I'm coming to show everybody what I've done. Dorian Yates showed up in 93, transformed bodybuilder that was unbeatable. I was the first guy to compete at the Mr. Olympia in condition over 250 pounds. Dorian was taking bodybuilding to a whole new level of impression. I mean, people were just getting overwhelmed with this size. But I had this drive and I had this system of high intensity heavy training which had gotten me from a backstreet basement gym in Birmingham in England to be Mr. Olympia. You know, once your foot's on the pedal, on the gas, it's a little bit hard to take it off. I was always covered up, I wasn't doing it for anyone else. And Kind of like I didn't want to show anybody because it wasn't ready yet. It's like an artist with this painting. They don't want nobody to look at that shit till it's finished. You gotta get angry, you gotta get you gotta push, you gotta visualize whatever helps you get through that set, you know? He has a heart of a lion, and you know, I doubt if anybody trained harder than this guy. When you do a set, you do one for mama, the babies, everybody. This guy's a first class, and a monster at 260 pounds, and as I've heard, better than ever before, Mr. Dorian Yates. I look back and I got a tremendous respect for this young guy, you know, because all the odds were stacked against. 
no family, you know, support and background and encouragement. You know, living on my own in a council estate, and it's just so far away. So I was just dreaming about it. <laughs> 